Today from LD Tech, the Project RPM 1.3 Genie Turntable. All right. Hi, it's uh, Brian Erb. I'm here from Project, here to show you the latest exclusive turntable from London Drugs. So this is the Project RPM 1.3 Genie. What's really interesting about the RPM, the very first thing that you're going to notice is the shape. The shape is very different. I'm going to take the belt off. This is our drive belt. So that I can show you some of the features of this. I'm going to take off the felt. The actual turntable itself is an incredibly dense MDF. So there's no resonance, there's no vibrations. Really interesting is at the bottom, we're actually using an inverted platter. So instead of the platter having the bearings at the bottom, this platter sits on top. There's a Teflon coating on it. The tolerances are within several decimal, 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 decimal um, millimeters of tolerance. So once we put it on, oh, sorry, I'll note one thing. You also notice the shape is different. We'll come back to that. Once we place it on, it will continue to spin basically without friction. So by doing that, there's no vibration through your record as it's playing, it's not adding any noise to what you're doing. Everything in a turntable like this is about avoiding noise. So the reason that it's this shape is that we can actually, with the spike feet, get rid of any additional noise and resonance. All of the stuff gets driven into the table or whatever you're supporting it on, no vibration. If you think of musical instruments, you don't have square guitars everything tends to be round because it gets rid of all the standing waves that creates that noise that your turntable needle is going to pick up. The next thing that we do is the motor is completely disconnected from the turntable. Amazing. As you think about it, when you turn on a motor, it's going to vibrate. By removing the vibration from the turntable, your needle is not going to pick it up. So everything that we have done for this turntable is to reduce all extraneous vibration so that the sound that you get from that vinyl is what the artist intended. There you go. <laughs>